safe ground is not the best solution for housing people who are homeless, but it is a great low-cost first step and is much smarter than, tr than criminalizing homelessness and arresting them when we don't have enough shelter space to house people. I just assumed as a citizen that there was a place for people to go. And I just assumed it was legal for people to camp. And it just blew me away that it's against the law to set up a tent in your own yard. So my, you know, when my kids would set up a tent in the backyard and camp, you know, if they did it more than a day, they were breaking the law. It's just absurd. Camping as in terms of housing is not a great solution for the rest of someone's life. But as a stopgap or a safety measure or a place when the rug gets pulled out from under someone to have a piece of land is simple. And the fact that there are people who are homeless that want to organize it and manage it and there are nonprofits that want to step in and provide the infrastructure and the resources and all we need is for the civil authority to make it legal and to, we can get private land if we need to. We can get the financial resources. We just need the backing of the government. And it, I mean, it just seems ridiculous that we don't have that. The soul of us as a people really hangs on how we care for those who are most vulnerable among us. And how we have been caring for them is we've been not caring for them. And how we've lived with ourselves is by making them invisible. And that's how we got to where we are, is we didn't want to see them as people. And we didn't want to see them as our concern. And they're both people and our concern. We don't want to believe that we're a culture that has that level of brokenness as part of us. We want to believe that we're a culture and a community that have it all together. And out of our togetherness, we're willing to help those poor people over there. So many people are hungry for someone to listen to them and to be in community with. And if there was a way to do it side by side with, other, with people that were homeless and cross those barriers as we're working together and having, learning about our families and our histories and our past, I think that would, it would not only help people who are homeless, but it would transform Sacramento. So listen to me, look around. Stay. You know there's gotta be some safe ground